everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with this orange cut crease look and I know it has taken me quite a long time to upload this video but life happened but I'm here now and thanks for rocking with me. First I'm going to start off using my Benefit Cosmetics Gimme Brow and I'm using it just for that reason to give me some brows because I don't have any. And then I'm going to take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade just to shape my brows and to fill them in. Now I'm just gonna take my concealer, which I forgot which concealer I use, and clean up underneath the brow and then blend it down and buff it out. Now I'm gonna take my Smashbox Photo Finish Eyeshadow Primer and prime my entire eyelid. Now using my Morphe 35K palette, I'm gonna apply this light beige eyeshadow right underneath my brow bone and then I'm blending it out. And then next I'm gonna apply this soft brown eyeshadow as my transition color right underneath that beige eyeshadow. And then taking this orange brown eyeshadow, I'm gonna apply this right in the crease and then blending it, blending it in to that soft brown and the beige. Now for the fun part, I am going to take my Makeup Forever 12 Flash Color Case. This is a cream-based black product. You can use a black gel eyeliner or whatever you have to create this cut crease line look. Once I get the line somewhat how I want it, I go over it to diffuse that line just a little bit with a flat eyeshadow brush. And this is just to hide any imperfections that you may have created in that line. And next I apply a black eyeshadow on top of that. And then I'm going to blend that upward and just keep adding a little bit more black and a little bit more black as I'm blending it until I get the right amount of smokiness that I'm looking for. Next, I'm going to take that gold cream from that same palette and apply it using a flat eyeliner brush. Now, I have to be a little bit more precise while applying the gold because I can't go back and diffuse this line. So, I'll just take my time and go little strokes at a time until I get the line as perfect as I can get it. Next, I'm taking Copper Sparkle Pigment by MAC and I'm just going to apply this right onto my lid underneath that gold line. For some reason, I got too far into the mirror and out of frame. So we're fast forwarding and I'm already on to the next eye. But basically, you can see, I'm just applying that, trying not to go too far onto that gold line. But I did a little bit, so I just touched up that gold a little bit more. Now I'm just gonna take this white frost eyeshadow and apply it to the inner corners of my eyes. And then I'm going to line my upper lid using a NYX liquid eyeliner. Next, I'm going to apply my V Lux lashes by INV and put these bad boys on. I absolutely love these lashes. They're very big, but they're very gorgeous. And then I'm just applying a nude eyeliner to my waterline and adding my mascara to my bottom lashes. And lastly, I'm gonna take my Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in Witches and apply it to these lips and then we have our finished look. And there you have it, our completed cut crease eyeshadow look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video or found some of these tips helpful. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and also hit that subscribe button. Until next time, always remember that none of us are perfect, but we are definitely beautiful inside and out.